Thanks for joining us here at 11. I'm Gabriella Rusk. A church in Jefferson caught fire last night as those storms rolled through our area. WMTV's Brooklyn Andres has been on the scene of St. John the Baptist Church all morning. Brooklyn, we know that the steeple of this church is what has the most damage. Yeah, you can kind of see the top of the steeple from where we're standing this morning, Gabrielle. I want you to try to get a, a good look up there on uh, that cross on the top is still holding on pretty strong. But now we know that cranes are headed to the area to begin removing that cross up there since last night's fire after it was contained and put out, which they worked on for hours. Um, they began putting up a fence around this church here in case that cross does come down at any point. They want to make sure that people are staying further back. Um, it, obviously to keep the community safe and we spoke with the pastor of St. John the Baptist Catholic Church earlier today and he says that the community is really coming together. It's a strong community. Unfortunate, you know, Mother Nature is powerful, um, but so is our faith. So we'll soldier on. So we do know right now that he said a taller crane is coming to the area. There's one right behind me, but it just would not reach the top of that steeple. So once they get that here, they will begin trying to remove that cross. And then from there, they can assess the damage. But right now we do know that no one was injured during last night's fire, but we don't know the extent of the damage to the church. For now, Gabriella, I'll send it back to you in the studio live in Jefferson, Brooklyn Andrews, WMTV 15 News.